Okay, this should go right. I doubt it though. Okay. Sorry to waste your time here, but let's get through these. Ow! New issues. Ow, I hurt my knee doing this. <laughs> All right, let's bring up the first issue, which is a past issue that's been shown on the other channel. And that is... Incredible Hulk 226. Um, in this particular issue, Dr. Banner reverts to himself after the Hulk um, uh, becomes enlightened by the statue of Socrates and he, he exclaims that he doesn't know who he is anymore, and Doc Sampson comes to his rescue. Okay. 227 is a, uh, let me check this here. This is a uh, 6.0. Six point oh. Let's get that over a little bit. Uh, this is a psychology issue with Doc, Doc Sampson trying to get into the mind of the Hulk, and uh, it, ends up, it ends up pretty bad. And this issue, which I just got in back. Happens between 227 and 228, and this is the Incredible Hulk King Size Annual number seven. So between 227, an uh, issue of the Incredible Hulk, and 228, this is a crossover between 227 and 228. By the way, this issue I could not get into a. <clears throat> This issue and the other annual, I could not get into a Ultra Po bag. Excellent art, by the way. Beautiful cover. Same thing here. I couldn't get this into an Ultra Po bag. Uh, Notice again that my comic shop keeps sending me logo variants. This is the Incredible Hulk annual, key size annual number eight, which I had in my collection. I also had number one, but those are, I'm gonna have to re reacquire that. I have three now and 11, and I have these two annuals which were in my collection. Marvel Team Up, number 48. It's from 1975. This one, 76, 75. Notice the uh, no logo variant here and a beautiful 25 cent there. There's no cross out here on the uh, th the uh, the barcode. And it's a beautiful copy. One of, one of three or four. This is uh, 6.5. Marvel Team Up 49, Spider-Man and Iron Man, continuing story with the, under the power of the Wraith, it's like a three or four part story, uh, story. All these were in my collection. A 4.5 copy of Marvel Team Up. 50, Spider-Man, Doctor Strange. A 6.5 copy of Marvel Team Up, which I just acquired, of Marvel Team Up, featuring Spider-Man, Doctor Strange. Better colors, nicer uh, condition. I'm wanting to get this anyway. 
We got book six, and we got five. See the difference in the quality of there. You can't see it really, but it's got a couple of creases right here. And completion of that story ends in Marvel Team Up featuring Spider Man and Iron Man number 51. So, getting all those issues completes that story. And that's the way sometimes Marvel does it. They'll split their stories up because the comic book can't really contain that much art and <laughs> dialogue. And recently acquired is a popular issue of Marvel Team Up number 53, Spider-Man and the Incredible Hulk. And the second part to that story is Marvel Team Up 54 featuring Spider-Man and the Incredible Hulk. So you've seen all the issues that I have out for the month. Cost me around six, no wait, three hundred, two hundred seventy-nine dollars, uh, give or take thirty-four dollars. So there you are. Those are the comics for this month. Thanks for watching. And if you want these issues, buy them yourself.